Do you know that you can grow your business and launch your business using grants and commercial real estate? So these are new startup grants using real estate and the best time to apply for these are now. Let's get started. Hey everyone, I'm Rindy from Ask Rindy. Welcome. Please subscribe to the number one community for real estate, income, grants, and credit. It's estimated that over $1.5 trillion in commercial debt is coming due and maturing between now and 2026, with over $390 billion maturing this year alone. So this is actually a huge problem in the commercial real estate space, and it's just the beginning of this huge storm. With more work from home opportunities, work from home businesses, and remote work policies, Many commercial spaces are remaining vacant. So this has actually created a perfect storm for the commercial real estate space. In response, many cities are creating grant programs to address growing vacancies. And I covered this here extensively on my channel where I shared with you cities like San Francisco and New York and much more that are creating these programs to address their growing vacancy problem in the commercial space. So this is actually an opportunity for you to actually launch and grow your business using these grants and these incentives that the cities are given to come in and establish your business. So these are another form of startup grants that you can use to launch and grow your business. Number one, New Jersey, Newark. The Invest Newark, Newark Retail Reactivation Initiative, $300,000 to $650,000 in grants. So Newark is New Jersey's largest city and I've had an extensive history with Newark, both as a resident and also as a top real estate agent in Newark. I've done most of my deals in Newark. So I'm quite familiar with both the residential as well as the commercial side of real estate within Newark. And Newark is a magnet for entrepreneurs and retail businesses. And the goal of this initiative is to make the downtown area more attractive. So they actually want to attract businesses to the vacant storefronts that exist all along Broad Street and all over the downtown area. So currently they actually have the Prudential Center where the Devils play, where they actually also had recently the VMAs. So they're currently attracting big ticket events and they actually want to increase that. So the grant's gonna be given out based on vacant space and square footage. So for example, as a new business, you must sign a two year lease based on the vacant space of a minimum of 1,000 square feet to qualify for this grant. And from there, it goes up. Businesses taking over 10,000 square feet can apply for $35 per square foot up to $300,000. Businesses taking $50 per square foot can actually get a grant of up to $650,000. So these are actually major numbers and incentives to actually establish your business and bring your business into the retail space and also the commercial space within Newark. And the grant can fund up to 90% of the eligible costs, both for interior as well as exterior improvements and also enhancements. Now, once you actually approve for the grant, Invest Newark would actually distribute 50% of the upfront cost so you can actually start the process of building out your retail space. Now, they do have certain requirements and criteria that you must adhere to once you receive the grant. Approved shops and businesses must be open for at least a minimum of five days per week. So to learn more about this opportunity and getting access to hundreds of thousands of dollars in grants to grow your business, to scale your business, you can actually go directly to Invest Newark's website at investnewark.org. You can also call them directly at 973-273-1040. Number two, California, Oakland. $10,000 in grants. So the city of Oakland is launching Activate Oakland. So this is actually a new grant program meant to attract businesses to the local downtown area. So this is actually a $400,000 program and it's meant specifically to be able to attract businesses to Oakland. Many businesses previously were actually affected negatively and they actually have left the city. They've left Oakland. Now they actually want to use this program to incentivize them and let them know that it's safe to return. Let them know that they can actually establish their business and thrive within Oakland by actually using these grant funds to actually launch their business and have ease of actually transitioning back into Oakland. So the grant program is designed like a sponsorship program where they'll give these businesses $20,000 to host free events and also pop-up events to attract traffic to their businesses. So this is likely like pop-up shops, retail, restaurants, all working together to synergize and actually grow and actually increase traffic coming into their zones and also in their businesses. And like many other cities all around the country, they're doing their best to make these grant programs easily accessible and also the process seamless for these businesses to actually acquire these grants and also transition into the spaces. Remember, this is actually a problem for them. Having vacant storefronts, having vacant space and commercial space sitting in their skylines 
are not good. They actually want to incentivize businesses by any means necessary to come in and actually have to start to generate some tax revenue, generate revenues that's coming into the city, generate life coming into the city. Because if people leave the city and there's not commercial movement in their downtown, that can actually kill the municipality and also kill the city's revenues. So to qualify for this Activate Oakland $10,000 grant, you actually must be an Oakland-based business. And the deadline to apply for this grant is October 12th. Now, if you'd like to learn more information and you're in that location, and you'd like to apply for this grant and see how you can actually grow your business and launch your business to the next level, you can actually go directly to their website at visitoakland.com forward slash activate dash Oakland. So if you'd like to learn more about cities all around the country that are actually having grant programs for businesses to start up, for businesses to actually get into commercial spaces and actually incentivize them to come in and give them the commercial space for pennies on a dollar, in some cases free, where they actually just want you to actually host events and generate revenues coming into the business and coming into municipality. So if you'd like to learn more about using startup grants and commercial spaces to launch and grow your business to the next level, how you can actually use grants and real estate and where you can actually find grants that match with real estate to actually grow your business, make sure you actually connect with us by joining us in our resource area. Every month we actually have a Zoom meeting where we actually discuss and strategize on our business and how to actually grow our business. You can actually do that by simply joining the network by going directly to my website at askrena.com, clicking on join and getting started today. If you'd like to learn more about how to actually go through the process of getting grants as an income stream for your business and actually the step-by-step -step process of how you can actually start to get grants for your business, you can also join us for our Grants Masterclass. Our Grants Masterclass is still open and it's currently 50% off. So make sure you actually take advantage of our Grants Masterclass by going to my website at ashwinder.com, clicking on Grants and getting started today. If you'd like to know all the grants currently available this month, make sure you watch our Grants of the Month video next and we look forward to actually seeing you guys on the next video. If you have any questions, please feel free to email me at askrenenetwork at gmail.com. And I look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. Until next time, thank you so much for watching.